be a great destiny helper. It is the earth that begins to juggle people so that they go where they did not plan, so that they meet you for you to actualize your destiny. It's the earth too. Yes, it's the earth. The earth can be defiled. Good news is also the land can be healed. Amen. Second Chronicles chapter 7 verse 14. If you've noticed whether the land is healed or defiled, words are involved. You need to continually speak to the land until it opens up to you. Keep saying, I will not struggle in Nairobi. I will not suffer in Nairobi. Don't mind what you're going through. Don't look at that. This Nairobi will not kill me. This Nairobi will not swallow my children. This Nairobi will not make me a wanderer. Keep saying it. Because words become records on the earth. The earth receives instructions from blood. From words, from blood. Blood is the strongest currency in the spirit after words. What is blood to you? What is life to you? Once released, it becomes a voice. Both in the heavens and where? In the earth. So it's very, very important to occasionally, as God gives you grace, release sacrifice. You must be a man of altars if you're to deal with things from the earth. And a man of altars is a man of sacrifices. You must culture your mind that way. Sacrifice is not losing. Sacrifice is winning. You become a man of altars. Everywhere Abraham went, what did he do? Raise altars. Everywhere he raised altars. Everywhere he raised altars. Till tomorrow, Abraham is speaking. Mindset. Endeavor to change your mind when the word of God comes. In other words, the mind of Christ should be your mind. The more the word of God comes to you, the more your mind is renewed. And the moment you start thinking differently, the earth begins to respond to you according to how you think. The moment you begin to think like someone who is rich and prosperous, the earth now begins to respond to you according to how you think. That's why as he thinketh. So when you begin to think that you are sick, the earth also responds to you with sickness. So when the doctor writes a report to you, you should not take it. In your heart, cancel it. Begin to tell yourself, I'm not sick. I don't have cancer. Words, blood, mindset will make the earth respond in your favor.